Hello, uh, channel right here, playing Armor 3, and today we are just going to check out if different radar systems work with the new um, on-call release of the uh, surface-to-air missile system Defender M145, I think it is. Yeah, M M M M I M 145 Defender. Uh, here it is, impressive looking thing it is as well, and this is a long range uh, surface to air missile system. Um, looks like one of those Patriot missile systems you see, and uh, it's all set up there. Now usually along with this you would place the, um, the radar system, which escapes me now, um, with it, but today I thought I'd give it a go with the weasel. Um, I just uh, turned this weasel into a blue fall um, vehicle. I just put my officer down and linked the weasel with my officer and that uh, uh, made it a blue fall vehicle. And you see it's, missile, it's a radar system um, on the top there, scanning the horizon. So, uh, so I thought I'd give it a go and see if it works. So here we go. Um, I'll have to create some enemies to come in to shoot down. So uh, I just use MCC. So uh, just log into that and uh, I'll put some uh, CSAT uh, jets down. So how I usually do this is the uh, best thing to do is really create a zone. Keep it as aggressive the zone, you can change it here and um, just create this zone up here in the north. I need to make it too big, just create it there in the northeast and then go to spawn and then choose. Uh, I'm going to choose some fixed wind, the Yak 130. It's a bit of a crap jet, I think, but it's. Um, it's for testing purposes. So I'm going to spawn a number of these in the zone. So just click on spawn in zone. And there you go. And then once I've got these, what I'm going to do is just highlight a few of them. Like that. Get them to uh, search and destroy this area here. There, double click and change the waypoint to search and destroy. So uh, replace, and that should bring them down. There we go. So I um, can't remember the uh, radar system. Is it sh it's the, the Shia? Is that the radar system that goes with the that came with the Encore release? And that is very effective. But today uh, I thought it should technically work with any. Um, any data link radar system, so I'm using this weasel here, which is like a just a bit like a car size, small, mini micro tank kind of uh, vehicle. So they're both set up here on the airfield here in Kittle. Check my MCC, make sure those jets are coming in. Yes, they are, as you can see. So I'll just wait for those arriving. Yes, yeah, so the Defender has a very long range, and it is, I think it's specifically for things like fixed wind aircraft and uh, helicopters and uh, larger type of drones. We'll pick them out, although it does have a problem picking out the smaller drones such as the A6 or the uh, Data A2. So uh, what I did was when I put the weasel down, I just checked that it was um, data linked. Um, I think by default it is anyway. It's there to send and receive, which is OK. and that. Um, and that the defender is there to receive, which uh, on default on my systems, uh, it's down as default. Now the weasel's radar, I don't think it's going to be as strong as the um, 
of the uh, shared radar system. So um, these jets should get quite close before they're uh, attacked, so we'll see what happens. Unknown contact. Three, there two, we go, we've got five, a contact eight, and the eight, missile system, SAM system three, is two, moving towards five, it. Eight, eight, two, The weasel's giving great co coordinates. I can't <laughs> see anything as a missile off. Yeah, and it's successfully shot those down. As you can see, because the radar isn't as strong, it's coming quite close. And it's fired all its four missiles. Ejected. 